Dear Gorilla Glue Girl. So who don't know Tessica Brown. Tessica Brown is now known as the Gorilla Glue Girl. You know, Tessica. Tessica was doing her ponytail. She ran out of gas to be glue. So she draw for the Gorilla Glue instead. I'm not lie, her ponytail is all laid. All laid to the guys, you know. Hey y'all. For those of y'all that know me know my hair has been like this for about a month now. It's not by choice. No. It's not by choice. When I do my hair, I like to, you know, finish it off with the little got to be glue spray. You know, just to keep it in place. Well, I didn't have any more got to be glue spray, so I used this. Gorilla glue spray. Bad, bad, bad idea. Y'all, look. My hair, it don't move. You hear what I'm telling you? It don't move. I've washed my hair 15 times and it don't move stiff wear whoa my hair so i'm gonna tell y'all like this if you ever ever run out of got to be glue spray don't ever ever use this unless you want your hair to be like that Look, y'all, look, look, you wipe it off and nothing happens. Like, this is the life that I'm living at this point. Like, this is the life that I guess I'm going to have to live. <laughs> yeah. Whether Tessica Brown was doing this for clout or perfection, meaning you know the perfect ponytail, it boils down to ignorance. This is a 40 year old woman who has three kids. You need to make better decisions in life, sis. But again, men know she do this for clout. We don't know. And I'm so tired of things going viral over stupidity. Like every time I see a video online where I talk about something uplifting, I'm like, I bet this not even go viral because it a talk facts. Too much facts is in this video, so it not go viral. Things like Gorilla Glue goes viral, you know. Now initially when I watched the video, it doesn't give me the vibe that she was doing this for clothes. It doesn't give me that vibe. It seems as if she wanted advice, but you know. The reason I went to the internet, because I never was going to take this to social media. The reason I took it to social media because I I didn't know what else to do. And I know somebody out there could have told me something. Yeah. I didn't think for one second when I got up the next morning, it was going to be everywhere. We all know how the internet works. We know if something stupid come online, like I just stated, it's going to go viral. We know say, I saw the thing set. So I don't know if Tessica Brown was sincere that she needed advice. I don't know. I blame this mistake if it is a mistake with lack of self-love, you know. And many know people as I say, oh, you always talk about self-love, self-love, self-love. Yes, because if you love yourself, you wouldn't be doing no dumb shit like that. If you love your hair and love your skin, you really gonna put Gorilla Glue on your hair. Have you ever used Gorilla Glue before? Yeah, I used it before and it worked pretty good. So oh, I you used it on your hair before? No, 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 no. Okay. Like I've used it on like for Christmas. Yeah. I've used it. Yeah, like if you love yourself, would you put Gorilla Glue in your hair? If you absolutely love every inch of yourself, yeah, go run with the Gorilla Glue foolishness. If got to be glue done, then it done. You should have wear the hat for real like you state. For me, I've I had to learn a lot of hard lessons when it comes to all the extremes I would go to for beauty. You know, like, cause girl, you see my edges too. Like, I like my hair to be laid. Right. And as black women, we have our tricks, you know, our things we do here and there. Um, but do you think you're at a point now where you're thinking about the extreme length you went to, to, to get this style perfect? Have you thought about that? Like maybe yeah. reconsidering that? I should have just put a hat on. Um, another thing is, I saw a video going around with this lady debunking it, debunking the Gorilla Glue Girl story. 
and she also used gorilla glue in her hair to prove that Tessica Brown was wrong and I thought that was stupidity as well. My Gorilla Glue, right? All that money people donated to that young lady is ridiculous because so many of us go to our kids' schools and our grandchildren's schools and we clearly see children who don't have school clothes. Their, their pants are tethered. Their shirts are tethered. Their little shoes are wore down. You know, so there's so many children out here that you could have really used that money other than somebody on a get-rich-quick scheme. The Gorilla Glue, right? My, my, that's my hair. Y'all watch me pull it down into the ponytail. That's my hair. How her hair stay black? How did your hair stay black? I can pretty much wipe because I put some stuff on it just to make it look like it's black. Yeah, oh, okay. I mean, I get where she's coming from regarding people at school or students at school needing the money. Meanwhile, celebrities and everybody else are donate to Gorilla Glue Girl. However, why you take it up on your head for debunk this? Why you not just make God do him work? That me just feel as if the, the, the world where we live in, uh, I be a stupid people that walk around. Why would you, why you gonna do that? Why you put Gorilla Glue in your hair? And why would you put, and for the girl where debunk the story, why would you put Gorilla Glue in your hair? For proof, say, home girl wrong. Like, do all of them dumb. Now, Tessica Brown have made, uh, you know, her, have gotten a lot of clout on this story she get enough money um there was this doctor in this surgeon we create this mixture to get rid of the gorilla glue he's popular as well i don't know if he would have really risk his license to get the clout i don't know would you do that for the girl who made the debunk story i think you are a lot worse in this situation because why you make it your business to prove that tessica is lying why you had to test gorilla glue after seeing what it might or might not have happened to tessica why you would actually test that theory out why are you so invested may i wonder if she low-key a look close as well if this young lady says she had her ponytail in for a whole month her ponytail originally started with a swoop. It originally started with a swoop, right? And she had little baby hairs on the side. Matter of fact, on, on, on this side, she had little swoops. I mean, the little baby hair, little baby hair. On this side, it was swoop, right? Right? <laughs> huh. Check these pictures out. If her hair was literally stuck with Gorilla Glue, how in the hell did she change the position of her ponytail? Because if her hair is swooped, I mean it was stuck swoop. How in the hell is all her hair being slicked back now? Here's the pictures. Here's the pictures. Check this out. Tell me how. Tell, tell, please, come on, come on. I got my ears up. I'm, I'm, there it is. The, um, the, I forgot the name of the stuff. We started with that. The and No, um, I didn't even say the name because I feel like they're going to make that a big meme. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, so we started with that. And as we doing it in the front, the baby bangs that I had. Yeah just started coming off like oh yeah well, i'm so tired of social media i'm tired of the internet and 
I just want to go back to the old days. The old days where people didn't have sense. The old days where people did think rational. This Gorilla Glue story is just so dumb. Clout is a, is a very nasty disease. If she's doing it for clout... And by the way, she started selling merch now. She's selling Gorilla Glue Girl merch. And that's something which is very contradicting. Because if you don't want to be known as the Gorilla Glue Girl, why you sell Gorilla Glue merchandise? If you regret it so much coming on the internet, why you sell merch? Not that person y'all trying to make me out to be. I'm not that person. I'm not this whole Gorilla Glue Girl. My name is Tessica Brown. Call me. I'll talk to y'all. Let you know exactly who I am. It's as if you're pushing that, yeah, me the girl a glue girl, da 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 da. You know, I, I don't know if she wanted to turn into a Kim Kardashian thing, you know, where Kim did have our sex tape and them try to make money out of the stupidity. I don't know if that's where she's going with that. I, mean, I know if she has somebody are talking her ear, say, girl, get something out of it. If you have a purpose, if you have, if you have something you did always want to do, see the attention here, yeah, yeah, get no push that, push that agenda. I think these type of attention they can be fleeting because today Airbo Girl A Glow, next month it's going to be something else. So what you do with this attention, I think it's important. I think she should do something more meaningful than make merchandise and still at it, attach herself to the Girl A Glow brand. Like no, after a while that I get tired. So do something else. If it was a simple mistake, it could be a blessing in disguise. What you do with your blessings, um, Tessica, that's important. If you don't know what to do, get some people on your team. Get some help now and no make no more stupid decisions, girl. Please, you know, just be wise. Wise up. <laughs> do you have people out there where our foundations have like, I try to promote self-love I try instill messages in young girls about confidence and them not get the attention but as soon as you paste like a girl a glue in your hair anyway guys this is the end of my little rant please like you don't even have to like it you don't even have to share it but if you're not subscribed subscribe this is just how I feel about this situation you know <laughs> anyway guys I'm out